Hi guys, welcome back. Today I'm back to set up a week in my health and wellness planner. I haven't done a plan with me or set up with me in a long time, but here I am. Let me just share with you how it looks on the inside. I really haven't changed anything or added anything, I don't think. Um, just keeping it the same way that I've had it. I think the only thing I added were these post-its. I like to have post-its here because... I often need paper to, you know, scribble on, so I added that. But besides that, I don't think anything else has changed. The back looks the same. And maybe this is the only other one that I added from, from Cauldron Customs that I love the Marie. She is just super cute. So obviously, like I mentioned, my health and wellness planner, I'm not going to share anything personal, obviously, but I have this cute cute little lexi kylie designs journaling kind of like kit since i kind of don't use a lot of journaling style um kits or you know stickers I'm, i thought i could use these for this planner and i think well should i color that in now that i'm thinking about it um no i'm actually just gonna leave it like that keeping it simple and I love these little dainty, dainty dates. They are just adorable. I love the cursive script as well. It's just like my favorite to write in cursive. <laughs> I think it's just like so fancy and like reminiscent of the old, old days. So yeah, so I'm so excited to be back kind of like... You know, sharing with you guys again, like my planners, because I love, love to share my planners. I have only been <laughs> sharing with you guys my hauls because those are like the easiest videos for me to film when I had family over, you know, like I've mentioned in a couple of other videos. But I think that looks so cute. I love it. I think if I were to have, if I would have added color. I probably wouldn't have liked it, maybe. So, like I mentioned, my health and wellness planner. Right here, I like to track my sleep, my steps, my hydration. And I think that's the only thing. My skincare. Yeah, those are the things that I like to track. So, I like to make those little trackers on this side. Oh, I think I could have put it a little bit lower. Oh, but it's so cute. Isn't that just, like, adorable? Oh, my gosh. I can't wait. These stickers are just gorgeous. Gorgeous. So I'm thinking I'm going to put this other one up here, but I'm going to put it higher. Right I think there. this one I want to use it down here. Kind of try to set it down straight. And these stickers are more of a plastic material, not washi material. But I, th I still think they're super cute. So right here, like I mentioned, what I track right so i'm thinking should i add because i could totally write over this like skincare you know um these my tweezers i forget and i have really stuck to like this planner and i have enjoyed it like so so much the only thing that i'm sad about and i didn't realize was that i'm running out of pages look how many pages i have left and I usually use about, let me see, one, two, I use about eight pages per month. And I have about one or two months left over here. So I was like, oh no, I was kind of sad about that. But I'm like, I'm going to just probably have to add a little bit more space here or be able to track whatever I track in the back over here. And, you know, all of that. So I'll do that there, then um, let me use this one. I think this one's cute. I love the vintage vibe of these. These, okay, so one, um, you won't be able to see it. Then this is gonna be upside down. Oh well, I'd rather it be upside down. So one, two, um, we'll use this one three four. Like I said, I track four things over here. 
And I do have a permanent marker that I like to use over these types of stickers because they often do smudge if you use just like um, a regular pen. But with that, there shouldn't be a problem. Oh, look at that. Doesn't that look super cute? Then another thing that I like to do is sometimes just add a little bit more deco, like on this side. I could totally add this one down here. Oh, I love it. I love it. <laughs> oh my gosh, these like uh, sticker journaling kits are just like my favorite i just love them so so much oh, i love it and i have this here because the glare of my light was a little bit strong so i was like let me not have that annoying glare on that table so i was like that would be better um, I think I like the layers right there. Maybe like that. And then I could put something here. Um, but I want to use this one too because it's so cute. But since... Let me see how oh, is this going to block my space here. my goodness that is just so cute and i think this one would be perfect here i love it love 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 it and i think i can use these two if i put this one over here it's gonna be And then this one, look at it, it's so cute, like a little um, notebook page. I'm going to go ahead and put this one here. Um, But, let me see. I think that's perfect. Oh, I think that turned out cute. And I used all the stickers, which is something that I'm trying to, you know, do this year oh my gosh that looks lovely this is like my favorite oh i love it i love it i love it oh my gosh so let me set up another one with you guys because um i want to set up maybe let me see this one with you guys and this one i'm gonna do a flip of my planners a while um maybe next next month so you guys can see how i've been using them and stuff but i figured that for this i would set up my in between page which really i just stick her up with like a bunch of cute stickers because i mean come on they're just gorgeous and i want to set up the week which i want to use these from simply gilded and I have some washi somewhere here. Let me see. I want to use this washi for this. So I can do that. But let's just have fun and stick up my, my page. Because you guys, it's going to be summer already. Oh my gosh. I just I am so excited. Even though it's not my favorite, I still enjoy it, you know. So I still like to enjoy it, even though it's not my favorite. So I like to just leave this kind of like open-ended because i'll just journal here or write ideas or anything you know that i want to write out <sighs> look at this isn't this cute ah i ripped it um so there's this one. Oh, i have more let me see let me put this one here then i can do the little seahorse so cute and then the flamingo i'll do the flamingo over here oh that looks cute like how cute is this little turtle oh i love it so usually when i um do this right here i like to 
oh am i in frame sorry if i wasn't um i like to kind of just decorate the borders because that just inspires me to you know be more creative and write a little bit more so i like to do that and then let me let me do this one the bigger octopus oh but is my flamingo gonna fit there is the question oh it's a little a little little too big but if i move this one over here and i move this one a little bit more i decapitated it oh my gosh had to be me had to be me not to worry not to worry and then let me see this pineapple is pretty cool i think i can put it up here this one's cute too do you guys like going to the beach i like going to the beach but at the same time i don't like going to the beach because i'm like the sand and i don't know i really love the sun and it's just like relaxing and everything but yeah i don't know just the sun is the best and the i j i'm just a little scared of the ocean honestly i don't like going in i had a really bad experience once and i was like i'm done i am done like we went to this area where there's like big tidal waves and we didn't know that and like literally i think it was like a 15 foot wave was coming and it picked me up it flipped me over slammed me on the floor and now i'm like oh my gosh i thought i broke my back i couldn't get out of the water my brother had to help me i think if he wasn't there i wouldn't have been able to get out i was like scared for life so that's one of the main reasons why i don't like the beach but i still like to take my kid and he likes to be on the edge of the water so that's okay i was gonna put that one there but i think there should be another one think. this one's nice stay anchored like that so like this i like to leave it like this and then i have the space to write in this section so then for my weekly i like to decorate the side then put a washi at the bottom usually i like to keep it um kind of like the same system so i okay my question i've asked this multiple times and nobody has ever answered me is there a way for the washi to be cut so it can be laid down on the other side like i don't like when i have to lay it down on this side because I just have to flip everything over. And then it's not like the proper way. I don't know. I'm just so used to it coming the other way. Like, you know, that this feels like it's the wrong way. So I'm like, why Why are some rolls rolled that way and some rolled out the same way? I, I don't know if that's a thing that can be adjusted or not or it might just be too exaggerated but i like when i have i can roll my washi from um left to right okay so this is simply gilded this is simply gilded and these are just gorgeous stickers like gorgeous gorgeous i will cover up that this weekend or this week i think it says because i don't often use it and i'm just gonna add most of these because they are just so cute and these i don't know if she has like this style of paper often but i like this it's a little bit thicker so it bulks up your planner a little bit more but i think it's fine i'm gonna put that one there I, they're just so cute i want to like i'm like which ones do i use because i want to use a lot of them but at the same time you know oh they're so cute 
I love this purple too. It's just like so perfect. Um, thinking, I kind of want to use this one. Well, I wanted to use this one for the weekend, but I guess it could. I don't know if the other one's gonna fit here. I could cut a little bit off of it too, so that should be fine. Oh, it fits. What if I go this way too? Yeah, you see it fits. Oh, perfect. Also, because I like to put some on the weekend. Just, you know, because usually on the weekends, this is my social media um, planner for my planners. <laughs> if I have to admit it, it's a planner for my planners, you guys. No shame. No shame. It's just, it makes me happy. I love it. So, I don't, on the weekends, usually I won't um do much so let me put it a little bit higher right there i can trim that little piece off oh that's cute and then over here what i like to do is i thought i had pulled my my other um because this is like a soft yellow so i was like oh that's just so cute i want to use my little dates my little dots from my little book that i have so i think this is going to be the week of 17 so starting 17 let me get that my little thing this is from i think it's from the happy planner if i'm not mistaken and these have come so in handy now that i use like planners that are like undated and stuff because it's just like perfect so handy so we started on the 17 we said and then i have really really been enjoying my planners and i have had fun you know this year i really said let me not focus too much on stressing out over a lot of the things that sometimes as planners we might uh stress about it let me just have fun enjoy it and really um enjoy the hobby because i love doing this and once it becomes like tedious or hard i'm like it's just not gonna be fun anymore for me so i'm like try to enjoy it as much as you can and just have fun oh my gosh i love it that's so cute so yeah guys that's how i'm gonna leave it i hope you guys have been enjoying my videos if you have please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys on the next one mm -hmm.